Hello, and welcome to Sama Dog's Weekly Meditation, where we set aside a few minutes to reconnect with ourselves and our very special animal friends. My name is Amanda Ree, founder of Sama Dog Wellbeing, a resource of education and support for the world's canines and their devoted humans. Now, I invite you to take a moment, get into a comfortable sitting position, and enjoy this guided meditation. Embracing Curiosity We have so much to learn from the dogs in our lives. Just by being themselves, they teach us lessons of unconditional love, present moment awareness, and the beauty of being curious. As many of you sat down for this meditation, your dog likely appeared and showed interest. There is no better friend than one that is genuinely interested in what attracts your attention. Have something in your hands? A canine wants to know what it is, what it smells like, and if it's edible. Every day is a new day for a dog, and every walk is a new adventure. Take the same route, and a pup will find something new to smell each time or they'll be content investigating the same old flowers as if for the first time. As children, we possess this same level of curiosity, but often lose it with time. Adult life comes with problems to resolve, responsibilities to meet, and goals to achieve. And as interesting as life sounds, it can feel as if there's no time left for curiosity. Yet, there could be. If we develop curiosity as a characteristic, much like our pups do, it begins to weave itself into our lives, enriching every area. Approaching life with interest opens us up to new ideas, opportunities, and adventures. It expands our capacity for empathy and strengthens our relationships all while it aids in our personal development and our enjoyment of life in general. So, let's start acting more like our dogs. Live life with enthusiasm, be inquisitive, learn more, and get lost in the wonder of it all. We can start embracing curiosity by investigating through meditation. Get comfortable and begin settling in. Maybe your dog is already with you. If not, go ahead and call them over, always letting the decision rest with them, whether or not they choose to participate today. Sitting in an upright position, keep your eyes open for a moment and take a few deep breaths. Simply notice your surroundings what do you see, hear, and smell? Keep breathing easily and see if you're able to notice the subtleties. Maybe there's a light hum in the room or a cool breeze from an unknown source. Take another long, deep breath in and slowly let it out. One more deep breath in and on the exhale, releasing all of your observations and simply rest. Now close your eyes and breathe normally through your nose, in and out, in and out. If your dog is next to you, lightly place your hand on their fur. If not, simply imagine it. How does it feel to be physically connected in this restful space? Can you feel their breath moving in and out? Begin to sink your breath 
to theirs, in and out, in and out. Each time we meditate together, we strengthen the human canine bond. And as we naturally develop this innate curiosity, we begin looking for more ways to explore together. A joint meditation practice is just one of those ways. Now, coming back to your breath, notice where you feel your breath inside your body, in and out. Now that you've connected with your dog, with your breath, and with your body, we'll introduce the mantra, I am bliss. Breathing easily and effortlessly, silently repeat the mantra to yourself, I am bliss. When we're totally present, we are blissful. Continue repeating, I am bliss. I am bliss. If you find that your attention has drifted off to other thoughts, noises in the environment, or sensations in your body, simply bring your attention back to the mantra. I am bliss. I'll mind the time while you meditate. When you hear a soft bell at the end of the meditation, please remain with your eyes closed.
gently release the mantra and rest with your eyes closed. Breathing normally and enjoy this restful state of being. Stay here for as long as it's comfortable, and when you're ready, slowly open your eyes. Living curiously opens us up to more of what life has to offer. A dog never loses their inquisitive nature and all the rewards that come with it. As humans, we tend to drift away from it but our dogs are always here as great reminders and constant inspiration. Commit to living curiously together, and we'll meet here next week for another human canine meditation. Until then, namaste.